Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. Question 40. Areas designated as hazardous classified shall be properly blank and shall be available to those authorized to design, install, inspect, maintain, or operate electrical equipment at these locations. Now our choices are A. Cleaned, B. Documented, C. Maintained, or D. All of these. Now at first guess I would say well all of these make really good sense and that's what your mom would tell you to do, right? Okay, now here's a thing. Uh, your mom didn't write the electric code. Okay? I mean with this thing I would say yeah all of these. Now if I want to come back to it though let me find out what it does say because I'm going to tell you right now D all of these is not the answer. So we need some key words. Well we could have hazardous or classified. So let's look for hazardous. That seems to be what we really want. So here we are in the index under hazardous areas and it says see hazardous classified locations which is actually just right down here. Now this is a huge section of the, this takes maybe uh, two, pages, two pages or so of the index. And as you start going down and looking at these, I guarantee you, you're going to find a lot of questions on hazardous locations in your test. So you've got to kind of learn how to navigate this section of the index too. And this includes like anesthetizing locations. And this side over here is also hazardous spray application. So, and it has things like lighting systems and hazardous, uh, protection techniques, things like that. Here are circuit breakers, t bonding. There's anything you can find in a normal location, you'll have to find in a hazardous location, and it's going to have to be done to a much higher standard. Okay, now if you try to go through here and look at something, we're, we're trying to find something that fits our answer, and that fits our question. What I found, I'm going to just go up a little bit because it's in this column, but a little farther up. And I had to read carefully, but when I did, it kind of jumped out. Hazardous locations is Article 500. That's where it starts. And here it says general. 500.4. So this is right at the beginning of it. And that could be kind of a technique. If you know the section, you can look for something right at the beginning it, if your question kind of warrants it. And the way our question is worded, it does kind of warrant that we look at it that way. Let's go back to the question again. Okay, so here's our question again. It says areas designated as hazardous shall be properly. Now, hazardous again if looking in your index it takes several pages of the index so we're looking at something that could be a general type question that's right at the beginning and remember it was 500.4 general so let's go there to that part of the code right now so here we are at 500.4 and the very first thing says documentation now that was one of our potential answers. It says all des areas designated as hazardous or classified locations shall be properly documented. This documentation shall be available to those authorized to design, install, inspect, maintain, or operate electrical equipment at the location. So that's word for word pretty much what our question was asking. Now before we leave, for, let me just point out, see this FPN? That stands for fine print note. And you'll see that throughout the code sometimes. So anytime you see that, that's what that stands for, fine print note. Okay, so anyway, we found documentation was going to be our answer here. And actually documented is the, is the word that appears in the answer. Documented is choice B on our test. Thank you for watching this video. Please click on the like and subscribe buttons so that I can continue to make more videos like this. If you find this video helpful, please consider donating using the PayPal link below. Thank you.